In this video, we are going to take a look at how we can get started with DV5. So if you are new to DV5, then this video is made for you. Now, if in case you don't know, DV5 isn't just another update from DV4. It's a complete rebuild from ground up, bringing you faster performance, awesome new features and fresh snappy interface. So whether you are new to DV or seasoned pro, then this video is your guide to getting started with DV5 and unlocking its full potential. So let's get rolling and see what this powerhouse can do. So let's break down everything step by step. First up, we need some basics in place like web hosting, a domain and WordPress setup. And don't worry, it's easier than it sounds. So let's talk about the step number one that is booking our business domain. And for this one, we always recommend website like Namecheap.com, which offers a wide variety of domain extensions at some amazing prices. And above all, you get a domain privacy for free of cost for lifetime. And if you want to get some exclusive deals on the domain that you're going to book, make sure you check out the link in the video description below. And once you click on that link, you will land up on page like this one. And here you just need to type in your business name. So let's say we try to book this domain and we are going to search for a .com extension. And once we enter the desired domain name, we just need to click on search to check if the domain is available or not. And this one shows available. So we can just go ahead and click on add to cart and then click on our cart on the top right corner and let's click on view cart. So on this cart page, we can see we are going to book this domain for one year. And along with that, we are also getting a domain privacy for free of cost forever, which means that whenever we are going to renew our domain, we are going to get the domain privacy free. So you don't have to spend anything extra to protect your privacy. And once everything looks fine, you can just go ahead and click on confirm order and you will be redirected on the checkout page where you can do the payment using your credit card or maybe you can use PayPal as well. Now think of web hosting as your website's home. It stores your website files and makes them accessible to your visitors. Now there are various hosting providers available including SiteGround, Pressable, Flywheel and Cloudways as you can see here on our DV hosting page. Now these providers offer hosting designed for WordPress and DV. So an optimized WordPress hosting ensures that your website is fast, safe and well equipped to run WordPress. And these hosts are designed to run DV flawlessly. Now of the four, we are going with SiteGround because it offers the most value for money, which is great for a beginner. SiteGround offers free email, site migration, SSL certificate and one click WordPress install. If you want to learn more about the web hosting that we recommend, make sure you check out the link in the video description below or you can visit elegantthemes.com forward slash hosting. Now in order to get best deals with the SiteGround hosting plans, make sure you click on the link in the video description below and this is going to take you to the SiteGround website and here you can just click on get started and choose your suitable plan. So let's say we go with startup plan which starts with $2.99 per month. So let's click on get plan. Now some website hosting company also provide a free domain for first year. And that's the case with SiteGround as well. If you want to book a new domain, you can enter the domain here and then click on continue and you will get a free domain for first year. But in case if you have already purchased your domain, you can go ahead and click on existing domain and then enter your domain name here and then click on continue. So you can enter your existing domain name here and then click on continue. And after that, you will have this checkout page where you first need to enter your account information. So here you can enter your email address, a strong password to create your SiteGround account. And after that, you just need to enter some client information. And after that, we have the payment information where we can enter our card details. And if we scroll down at the very bottom, here we can see the order summary says we are getting this hosting plan for one year for $35.88 only. So you can go ahead and do the payment and complete the checkout process and I'll see you on the other side. So once we are done with the purchase of our hosting plan, we will see this dashboard once we log in in our SiteGround account. And from here, we need to go to websites. And this is the panel where it will show all the websites that we are going to host with this hosting plan. So as we are going to add a new one, so we click on new website 
and here we again get an option to book a new domain or we can link our existing domain with this hosting account or if you want to just see how everything works how you can use the hosting panel and various other stuff you can use the temporary domain from here and once you connect your domain we will land up on this page where we can either start a new website or we can migrate already existing wordpress website to our SiteGround account but right now we are going to build everything from scratch so we are going to click on start new website and then click on select from here and after that we can choose whatever application we want to install so here we have option for wordpress we can install wordpress along with woocommerce that is the e-commerce plugin for wordpress or we can also install weebly site builder but right now let's go ahead and install wordpress from here so we click on select and here we need to enter the email address that we are going to use to log in in our wordpress setup and after that we need to enter the password to log in in our wordpress backend so i would highly recommend that you go ahead and click on generate so that you can have a strong password for your login and after that we just need to click on continue and after that we have an option to add site scanner as an additional service so we can go ahead and skip that and click on finish now it's going to take a few seconds to do all the backend stuff and we will be ready with our fresh wordpress copy installed on our siteground hosting server all right so we are done with our setup and here we have three options we can go and visit the front end of our website so let's click on this so this is how the wordpress front end looks like and we are going to customize everything here and after that we have an option to access the wordpress backend so we can click on this and it will take us to the wordpress backend but let's go ahead and click on websites and here we have our website which we have just created on the siteground hosting server so in order to log in in the wordpress backend we can simply choose the wordpress admin button right here let's click on this and this is going to redirect us to the back end of our wordpress setup so here is the welcome screen of wordpress starter from siteground itself so let's click on exit this wizard and here we are in a fresh copy of our WordPress setup. Now that the WordPress setup is up and running, it's time to bring Divi 5 into picture. So for that, we need to go to this URL, elegantthemes.com forward slash Divi 5. And from here, we get an option to download Divi 5 public alpha. Now, if in case you are new to Divi, then make sure you check out our pricing plans. I would highly recommend to go with Divi Pro for all its extras like Divi AI and Divi Cloud. So let's click on this. And once we are inside our members area, we can scroll down here and we get an option to download Divi 5 Public Alpha. Let's click on this. And here we got the zip file downloaded. So now come back here in our WordPress backend then go to appearance and then themes and here we click on add theme and now click on upload themes and here we need to add the zip file that we have just downloaded so we click on our download option here and drop our zip file and then click on install now and once the installation is done, let's go ahead and click on activate. And boom, we have successfully installed the DV5 public alpha on this WordPress setup. And now it's time to activate our license. And for that, we can either go back to our DV account or we can simply do this activation from here itself. So we just need to click on login to activate your license. Let's click on this. And then we will log in with our Elegant Themes account. And now we have successfully activated our DV license and we are back in the DV dashboard. And now in order to get started with DV5, let's go ahead and start creating our page. So we go to pages and then click on add page. Let's close this box and let's name it something like home. And then we will click on use DV builder. And it's going to open the DV5 Visual Builder. And here we are inside our DV5 Visual Builder. Now this might look familiar if you have used DV before, but trust me, it's packed with upgrades. First up, the Layers View is your ultimate tool for managing complex layouts. DV5 has upgraded this feature, making it more accessible 
on the left sidebar. With the layer panel, you can see all elements in your layout at a glance, select hidden or overlapping modules without frustration, and search and filter elements to quickly find what you're looking for. Now imagine you are updating all your call to action buttons. For that, open the layers panel, search for button, and select each one to update its settings without digging through the canvas. Dockable panels and one-click editing are your next new best friends. These features let you keep update settings panel open while making quick edits with just a single click. And here is a pro tip for that. Dock panels like layer view and module settings on one side of your screen to minimize cursor movement and boost your workflow efficiency. For example, when editing button text across multiple modules, dock the layers and button panels together. This setup lets you switch between sections effortlessly. Setting panel breadcrumbs. Breadcrumbs are unique feature in TV5 that makes navigation between parent and child element a breeze. When editing a module, breadcrumb appears on the top of the settings panel. Click the breadcrumb links to move to parent elements like rows, sections without closing the panel. For example, let's say you are working on a contact form. Use breadcrumbs here to adjust the row or section settings without leaving the module panel. Now responsive design just got easier with canvas scaling. This tool lets you visualize, resize your canvas in real time to preview design for desktop, tablet and mobile devices. And here is a pro tip for that. Use this canvas scaling to tweak padding, fonts and layout for smaller screens without switching to preview mode or resizing your browser window. For example, after adjusting desktop text, scale the canvas to mobile view to refine the layout and ensure everything looks perfect on smaller screens. Finally, streamlining interaction layers in TV5 is a game changer for animations and responsive design. Design options for hover, sticky and responsive state are built directly into settings panel. Toggle between these states to preview effect and make adjustment without leaving the build. Now let's talk about the exciting stuff. DB5's new features and even in its alpha phase, it's already loaded with tools to supercharge your workflow. You can play around with options like option group preset, which let you save settings like borders or typography and apply them anywhere in just one click. Then we have design variables, which gives you control over colors, fonts, spacing, which you update once and it changes everywhere. Then we have advanced units like clamp function or calc function, which makes responsive design a breeze. Then we have nested rows and module groups, which offers insane layout flexibility. And we have covered everything in a separate video that you can watch in the i button above and we will link all the videos in the description below as well. And this is not it. There are more coming like Flagbox layout and WooCommerce enhancements. All right, so let's wrap this up. Divi5 isn't just a tool. It's your whole new way to build websites that are faster, smarter and ready for anything. From its rebuilt core to its cutting edge features is designed to help you work like a pro and scale with ease. If you're starting a new project, now is the time to dive in and become an early adapter. So go ahead and head over to elegantthemes.com and download DB5 Public Alpha today and start building something amazing. And want more details? Go ahead and check out the full blog post that we are going to link in the video description below. And if you like this video, then make sure you give it a like and share it with your friends and community. And for more DB updates, don't forget to subscribe this channel and hit the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever we upload our next video. That's it for this one and I'll see you in the next video.